Hello, I'm Jomica, and welcome to OCRP. It is a Grand Theft Auto V role-playing server based on Orange County in Florida. Uh, when I first joined, I at first thought it was Orange County in California, but that's not the case. Um, so today, we're going to go ahead and get started. And this guy named John Kozos? Kezos, I forgot what I named him, uh, I wrote it down, John Kezos, uh, he's a tech executive, he started a company called Nile.com, and he is moving into the city, so we're going to go ahead and put the top down, uh, the company is still in its early stages, uh, he doesn't have too much money, um, but he definitely wants to move in to the area, and he has a few houses lined up that he wants to take a look at. And it's three these three houses up here. So we're going to go ahead and set a route. And we will head that direction. So. Yeah. The server itself is whitelist only. And you must be at least 18 to apply. I know right now applications are currently closed. They had something like 3,000 applicants uh, as soon as they opened. So they've been going through those and they're down to like 500 or so applicants that they have to go through before they decide and finish that up. And I think they said that they were gonna open, open applications again, hopefully in June. So if this is something you wanna join, uh, go ahead and visit their website. I'll leave it in the description, and that'll be where you can find out when applications are open. And when I do find out that applications are open again, I will go ahead and let you guys know in a future video that I do. I plan on doing... I'm going to try to stick to a video a week. Who knows if that'll happen. Work's going to be pretty busy in the next month or so. So I'm going to try to do my best to try and get some more videos. I know it's been a while since I've done one, um, but this kind of is getting me motivated to do some more videos again. I've been playing on the server for, I don't know, maybe maybe a week. And been having some fun, just kind of screwing around, not getting into too much trouble. But yeah, I am a Civ on the server. They have civs, police, or law enforcement agency. And I'm not sure if they have fire yet. Um, but they do have a lot of things planned in the future of the server. Like I said, it's only about a month old now. So still working out a few things, adding things as they go, and making it a better experience for everyone who plays and makes videos and all that stuff so if you want to see some other people on the server that do videos or just do streaming check out twitch there is a community called OCRP and you can see whoever's streaming at that time if you check out that community and I know when I'm not playing I will check on people see who's playing and see what they're up to from time to time so let's go ahead and head to these houses and we'll check them out and see kind of which one we want to move into I think we're pretty short on money we're gonna have to wait for Nile.com to start making some money before we can really do anything but I think we're gonna start out renting and, I mean, I don't think we're going to be able to afford anything with 100000 less than that. But we'll see what the price is when we get there. And i got to make sure I don't speed too much through the city. I can run a red light here or there. It's not too big of an issue, but we'll go ahead and get there relatively soon. Yeah, John is a pretty impatient guy. He doesn't like to wait around for anyone. So, 
Let's see. Make sure we don't take a wrong turn anywhere. And I think right now there's not too many people online. It's uh, midday on Saturday. At least my time. I'm in the central time zone, so probably midday for most people on the server. It seems to be more active in the evenings. But still fun to hang around and see what people are up to. So <clears throat> we are pretty close to the house. We'll just cut this guy off. He's taking too long. You're going too slow. And this car that I'm driving is very slow acceleration if you're already moving. All right, so here's the first house. First off, I don't like that. There's not really anywhere to park. So we'll turn off the car and we'll get out. Got dirty pretty quick. And we'll head inside. We will check available properties. So yeah, it's 300,000. Um, no, not buy. Visit. Go in, see what it looks like. Nice little kitchen, dining area, and living room. Got that telescope so we can spy on our neighbors, see what's going on downtown. I'm pretty sure all the houses in this area will have the same kind of similar setup. I like that moving painting back there on the stairs, probably like a waterfall type thing. And this is our bedroom. Got the balcony here, this random chair that, I'm not sure why you'd put a chair facing like that, but that's okay. Um, and this is bathroom, another one of those moving paintings. Pretty nice bathroom. I wouldn't mind having one of these myself. And closet there. I think there was one more floor. Yeah, we'll head down. Definitely couldn't have one of these in my own house. The dogs would be licking the wall all the time. Um, okay, nice little office. I actually like the office. A little home office here for our tech CEO guy. Um, little lounge area, waiting room, I guess, for if I have meetings in the home office. Not that I ever would. So we will head up and out. Are those speakers? Yes, they are. I like that. So we'll head out and we'll check out the second house. I'm not a big fan of this one. I mean, the inside's nice, but the inside is going to be pretty much the same everywhere. Um, this one's kind of the same outside. I'm sure it's exactly the same on the inside. So we'll skip that one, and we'll go in if we don't like this guy over here. So, where are you? Actually, I like this one better already. Got the nice overhang here, nice place to park the car. So when it randomly starts raining and we have the top down, we're okay. So let's go inside and take a look. 2874. So we'll go here and visit and head inside again. Kitchen, not my color, but that's all right. I like the couch here. We got our telescope. So we can watch all the police activity going on down the hill. Got a pool over there, neighbors we can use. And I guess this is where the TV goes. Maybe. Nope, there's a TV over there. Not sure what that is. But okay. 
So we will head this direction, head downstairs. We've got a camera up there. No, nope, those are lights. We don't have one of those waterfall walls, which I guess is good because I don't want the dogs licking the walls all day. So we've got different chairs, still one looking out. Kind of a weird balcony here. But maybe it's just not displaying. Got another bathroom here. I like the floor better in this one. And we'll go ahead and check downstairs, see if that home office is also in this one. I'm pretty sure it should be. So yeah, we got the waiting room here. And we do have our home office. Got our little, I guess, paper wall here. Okay. All right. We got our football so we can throw it at somebody. We also have our baseball right here. But that's the only weapon we really have. More just to mess with people than anything. But we only got one of those, so we'll save it for something good. Yeah, I think we'll take this one. So let's head back outside. And we will go into this little guy. Access the menu, available properties. That guy, rent. So, 1500 It's not bad, we can afford that. So now we have the property. Actually, let's head back in and see. Enter. See what we can do in here now. I don't remember what you can and can't do inside a house. I know you can change your clothes, you can store dirty money, and I'm guessing food? I really don't remember. Maybe something I have to mess with in the future off camera. So head downstairs and just check real quick. This was our bedroom floor? Yeah. Go in the closet. Is it nothing in here? I swear you could. Oh well. We'll check the office. I mean, I guess it's something I'll figure out later. Um, yeah, nothing really in here. Oh, there we go. Access the menu. Invite a player, close. Deposit object. Dirty money, hamburger, cheeseburger. I guess bottled water, hamburger, not cheeseburger. So yeah, I don't have any clothes or anything like that, but we'll get some more later. Also, I don't have any dirty money. That may be something we also do in the future. I don't know about this guy though. He, maybe his brother. This guy is too in the public eye to be doing that kind of stuff. And we left our car running. So I think what we're gonna do is to celebrate we will head down to Tequila La, get a drink, and we'll see what's going on down there. I'm gonna guess not too much, but who knows, maybe somebody will be there. I could say hello. And I will also need to update my address through the DMV just so everyone knows where I live get all my mail, my car registration, and all that sent to my house. Because I think right now it has my old address, which is nowhere near uh, the city of San Andreas. 
So, let's see. Where do we want to park? We'll just park out front. I think there's parking spots. And there don't seem to be. So let's make an illegal U-turn here. And we will make a left turn here. It says it's red, but it's an unprotected left turn. So we're good. And we'll just park in the back here. No parking. Yeah, we're okay. So let's go through the front. We won't worry about going up through the back. And he's in a real hurry to get that drink. Let me add that sweet back door. So let's... Is this the entrance? Looks like it. Nope. This also looks like an entrance. There we go. Hey, does anybody know how to drop a truck off in the depot? Never actually been in here. Oh. So let's go ahead and get ourselves a drink. Mine never gave me that option. And we can ignore uh, those guys in TeamSpeak. Let me go ahead and yep. mute that. Yeah, it, and we'll get another beer. Let's go ahead and drink the beer. A little drunk now, but we're good. We'll party. Let's see if that is a thing. So we're partying, having a good time, celebrating with all these people. And let's go home. We'll sleep it off. Head outside. And this is where we want to play it cool. We don't want to get in trouble with the cops. It's like noon and he's already wasted off one beer. But that's all right. So we'll head back to our car. And then we'll sleep the first afternoon and night in our brand new home that we are now renting. And he can kind of set himself up, get everything he needs. And then he can explore the city a little bit more later. And since he doesn't really know where he lives yet, we're going to go ahead and put that in the navigation forum. And it looks clear now. So we'll go ahead and head up the mountain. And yeah, this is a little difficult to see. He's not swerving, so he's okay. Make it a little more. Roll played a little bit more. We don't need our lights. Turn those off. And then we will turn left on this street. And we are almost home. One last turn. Nope, one more turn. And here we go. Make sure we put the top up. We'll have to get the car cleaned another day. Turn off the car. Go ahead and get out. And enter our home. And actually, he's going to go ahead... He's too tired to make it downstairs, so he's just going to go right here and lay on the ground, if I can spell it right. There we go. And he's just going to go to sleep face down. So, 
John's going to get some sleep, and he will be back hopefully next week. Maybe he'll be back with a different character, um, and we'll actually do a little bit of something on the server. He doesn't look like he's feeling so well. But thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys next time.